The Z car is a series of sports cars manufactured by Nissan Motors Limited. The original Z was sold in October 1969 in Japan as the Nissan Fair Lady Z and was sold in Japan at Nissan exhibition dealerships that previously sold the Nissan Bluebird. It was exported as the Datsun 240Z. Since 2009 Nissan has manufactured the newest Z, the Nissan 370Z. The earlier models of the Nissan Z were built at the Nissan Shitai plant in Hiratsuka until 2000, while the later models are built at Opima and Tokiji. Enthusiasts praise the cars for their looks, reliability, performance, and affordability. Every Z car has been sold in Japan as the Fair Lady Z and elsewhere under the names Nissan S30, Nissan S130, Nissan 300ZX, Nissan 350Z and Nissan 370Z. History. Nissan was a relatively small automaker when it entered the international markets in the 1960s and partnered with Yamaha to design a new sports car prototype to update the Nissan Fair Lady. Nissan executives saw the prototype as a halo car that would improve their company's image in the minds of consumers. By 1964 Nissan realized that Yamaha's DOHC 2.0-liter engine was not meeting Nissan's expectations and the project was scrapped. Yamaha later finished a prototype and took their design to Toyota, resulting in the Toyota 2000 GT. Yutaka Katayama, the president of Nissan USA at the time, realized the importance of an affordable sports car internationally. Nissan had already produced for many decades the successful series of Fair Lady Roadsters that competed mainly with English and Italian Roadsters, and product planners envisioned a new line of GT cars that would be stylish, innovative, fast, and relatively inexpensive through the use of interchangeable parts with other Nissan vehicles. Nissan also had the engineering background and product development experience with the recently acquired Prince Motor Company, which manufactured the Prince Skyline that was later renamed Nissan Skyline in 1966. The 240Z design project was carried out primarily by ten people, Mr. Yutaka Katayama, Mr. Tiichihara. Mr. Kazumi Yotsunoto, Mr. Yoshihiko Matsuo, Mr. Akayo Yoshida, Mr. Tsuchiba, Mr. Aichi Oiwa, Mr. Kichi Nishikawa, Mr. Hidemi Kamahara, Mr. Tsunio Benatani. Equals first generation, Nissan 240Z equals. Sales of the Nissan Z car started on October 1969, with two separate versions, one for the Japanese market and one for the U.S. market. The Japanese Fair Lady Z featured a 2.0 LSOHCL 20A inline 6 producing 130 picoseconds, while the US 240Z featured a 2.4 LL24 inline 6 with twin Hitachi SU type carburetors that produced 151 horsepower. A third Z, the Z432, shared a performance version of the DOHC 2.0 LS20 engine with the Nissan Skyline 2000 GTR. In Japan, the Z was still known as the Fair Lady to keep the car in line with the previous generation Datsun Sports Roadster. JDM versions had the Fair Lady Z badge on the lower fenders with the 432 badge above. However, Yutaka Katayama ensured the American version had all Nissan, Fair Lady Z, and 432 badging replaced with Datsun, and prevented all dealer shipments until they were replaced. The 240Z was released in America on October 22, 1969. Combining good looks, and powerful performance, it sold over 45,000 units through the 71 model year and over 50,000 and 40,000 in 1972 and 1973, respectively. The 260Z was released in 1974. It featured an increased engine displacement of 2.6 L and an available 2 plus 2 model with a slightly longer wheelbase. Despite the engine size increase, power decreased to 139 horsepower in most areas of the U.S. due to new camshafts, carburetors, and lower compression that were introduced to comply with new emissions regulations. In other export regions the power was increased to 154 picoseconds. The 280Z was released in 1975 in North America and featured another engine displacement enlargement to 2.8 LA major change was the introduction of Bosch fuel injection, replacing the previous SU carburetors. 
This resulted in a power increase to 170 horsepower, offsetting increased weight from added luxury features and an enlarged bumper that met U.S. federal regulations. Export markets outside North America continued to receive the Datsun 260Z until the introduction of the Datsun 280ZX at the end of 1978. Equals second generation, Nissan 280ZX equals. Known as the Datsun Nissan 280ZX in export markets, the car continued to use the Fair Lady moniker in the Japanese domestic market where two-liter inline-six engines were also available and was first introduced in 1978. The only thing that was left unchanged from the previous 280Z was the five-speed manual transmission and 2.8-liter L28 inline-six engine, while the entire car overall was made more luxurious to meet growing consumer demands. Major changes for this new generation of Z cars include T-tops, introduced in 1980, and a turbocharged model introduced in 1981, complementing the naturally aspirated two-seater and NA2 Plus 2 models. Coupled to either a three-speed automatic or five-speed manual transmission, the turbocharged model was capable of 180 bhp and 203 lbf AFT of torque, over the 135 bhp and 144 lbf AFT of the NA engine. Notable models include the 10th anniversary edition, featuring gold emblems, gold alloy wheels, and two-tone paint in either gold red and black, with luxury features such as leather seats headlamp washers, and automatic climate control. The 280ZX was wildly popular, being hailed as Motor Trend's import car of the year for 1979 and going on to set a Z car sales record of 86,007 units in its first year. While on the one hand it received praise for taking the Z car to further levels of comfort and performance, many enthusiasts also lamented the further emphasis on luxury over driving fun. This would continue with a third generation of Z car, with a clean sheet redesign that would take the Z car to further heights. Equals third generation, Nissan 300ZX equals. The Z car was completely redesigned in 1984, and introduced Nissan's new series of 3.0 liter V6 engine, dubbed the VG series. The same engine was used in the electromotive GTP ZX Turbo that dominated the IMSA GTP races in 1988 and 1989. These were available in both VG30E naturally aspirated and VG30E T turbocharged forms producing 160 and 200 bhp respectively, although some VG30E T powered Z cars exported outside of the US produced 228 bhp due to a longer cam duration and less emission restrictions. These were showcased in sleek new wedge-shaped styling and given a new name, the 300ZX. Like its predecessor, it also proved to be wildly popular and was the second best-selling Z car in history selling over 70,000 units due in part not only to its new styling but also to even more added luxury features and high performance. When the 300ZX Turbo was released in Japan, it offered the highest HP available in a Japanese standard production car at the time. Much like the 280ZX that preceded it, the first Gen 300ZX was thought by enthusiasts as more GT than true sports car. It had improved handling, acceleration, and refinement on any previous model Z car. Nissan made various changes and claimed improvements to the Z31 model through its entire production. In 1983 Nissan first offered the 300ZX in Japan. It was introduced in the US one year later. All U.S. market 1984 model Nissan vehicles carried both Datsun and Nissan name plates. Along with the arrival of their new flagship sports coupe, Nissan launched an aggressive marketing campaign to promote the brand name change from Datsun to Nissan. The 1984 models can technically be considered the only year of the Datsun 300ZX. The 1984 300ZX 50th Anniversary Edition was released in celebration of the company's 50th anniversary year. It was based on the standard 300ZX Turbo, but was outfitted with every luxury feature available a unique black interior with bow sonic leather seats in addition to widened fender flares, requisite badging, rear quarter panel flares, and 16-inch wheels. For the 1985 model year, Nissan dropped the Datsun name brand for good, 
but the car dealers were still known as Datsun dealers. Paul Newman raced in the 1985 GT1 Challenge and won. This was Newman's fourth national championship. Minor changes were made to the 300 ZX including a water-cooled turbocharger, smoke taillights, and body color bumpers. The 1986 model saw wider flared wheel wells, and the rear quarter panels were designed specifically to accommodate factory ground effect style side skirts. 1986 turbo models were equipped with an ordinary hood, markedly losing the turbo scoop on the driver's side. In order to keep up with quickly aging aesthetics, another slight redesign happened in 1987, consisting of new rounded, restyled and longer front and rear bumpers, new headlights, and new tail lights. The black trim on turbo models was now a charcoal instead of gloss black, and 1987 turbo models came with special smoke turbo finned wheels. All 1987 model year turbo cars also received an upgraded manual transmission, larger and more powerful brakes, and turbo cars produced from 4-87 and later came equipped with a clutch-type limited slip differential. For the 1988 models, there were again a few small changes. The turbocharger was switched from the Garrett T3 turbo to a lower inertia T25 turbo, and the engine from 7.81 to an 8.3 to 1 compression ratio in order to reduce turbocharger spool time and provide instant boost at any usable RPM. The interior aluminum accents and chrome door handles that adorned the earlier cars were dropped in favor of matching color parts. Another special edition, the Shiro Special, was released in 1988. It was only available in pearl white. The SS package consisted of analog gauges and climate controls with a black interior, stiffer sway bars, stiffer springs, non-adjustable suspension, special seats, a viscous coupling limited slip differential, and a special front lower lip spoiler. This package had no options. All 88 SS cars are identical. The 1989 models are identical to 1988 models, though somewhat rare because of Nissan winding down production early in preparation for the second generation 300ZX. Equals fourth generation, Nissan 300ZX equals. The only thing that remained unchanged from the previous generation 300ZX is the 3.0-liter V6 engine, now with dual overhead camshafts variable valve timing and producing a rated 222 horsepower and 198 lbaft in naturally aspirated form. The big news for enthusiasts, however, was the turbo variant, now upgraded with twin Garrett turbochargers and dual intercoolers. This was good for 300 horsepower along with 283 lbaft of torque. Performance varied from 0 to 60 times of 5.0 to 6.0 seconds depending on the source, and it had a governed top speed of 155 miles per hour. Upon its release, the new 300 ZX became an instant hit, winning Motor Trends Import Car of the Year in 1990 as well as one of the top 10 performance cars. Automobile Magazine honors the 300 ZX 300 ZX Turbo as its design of the year and add it to their all-stars list. Road and Track names the 300ZX Turbo one of the 10 best cars in the world, and Car and Driver adds it to their 10 best for the seven years in which it was in production in America. American Z car sales reached a 1 million sales mark in the 1990 model year. Nissan utilized the Cray II supercomputer to completely design the new 300ZX with a form of CAD software. This made the 300ZX one of the first production cars to be developed in a CAD program. In return, it featured a whole host of technological advancements. On the twin-turbo models, four-wheel steering was available under the name Super HICAS. The twin turbochargers, intercoolers, and requisite plumbing left for a cramped engine bay. However, everything fit perfectly. Like previous generations Nissan offered a 2 plus 2 model with the Z32. In 1993, a convertible version was introduced for the first time in the Z car's history, as a response to aftermarket conversions. All 300 ZXs now featured T-tops as standard, yet there were some rare hardtops produced as well. 
the 300ZX was doomed to the same fate of many Japanese sports cars of the time. The mid-90s trend toward SUVs and the rising yen, dollar ratio were both influential in ending North American 300ZX sales in 1996 at over 80,000 units sold. Probably the biggest killer of the 300ZX was its ever-inflating price. At its release it was priced at about $30,000, but in its final year this price had increased to around $50,000. This left many people questioning its value, and despite a final commemorative edition of the final 300 units shipped to America, the Z car was on hiatus. In Japan, however, the 300ZX lived on for a few more years with a facelift including a new front fascia, tail lights, headlights, rear spoiler, and a few other minor changes. Equals Nissan 240Z concept equals. In America the Z car went on hiatus from 1997 to 2002, as Nissan focused more on SUVs and was also in some financial trouble. To keep Z car interest alive, Nissan launched a restoration program in 1998 for which they purchased original 240ZS, professionally restored them, and resold them at dealerships for about $24,000. Nissan next launched a concept car at the 1999 North American International Auto Show, the 240Z Concept. Clearly a throwback to the original, it was a bright orange two-seater with classic swept-back styling. In addition, it was fully functional, with the 2.4-liter .4 four-cylinder KA24D engine from the Nissan 240SX featuring 200 bhp and 180 lbaft of torque. The designers used an original 240Z to provide inspiration and the concept was created in only 12 weeks. The running concept, featuring a four-cylinder engine compared to the Z car's traditional six-cylinder engine, was eventually thought less than a worthy successor to the line. Equals fifth generation, Nissan 350Z equals. In 1999 the French company Renault bought 44.4% of Nissan and Carlos GHOS and became its chief operating officer. But it would not be until 2001 when Carlos GHOS and became CEO that he would tell reporters, we will build the Z. And we will make it profitable. On January 8, 2001, Nissan introduced the Z concept. Much like the previous Z concept, it debuted at the North American International Auto Show and was painted a bright orange. The squat, long hood short deck styling resulted from a competition between Nissan's Japanese, European, and American design studios, with the La Jolla, California studios design being chosen in March 2000. The product planners hoped to avoid the price problems that plagued the last few years of the 300ZX with a target MSRP of $30,000 while using the Porsche Boxster as a benchmark. In the summer of 2002, the 350Z was released to wide acclaim. It employed a slightly improved version of the 3.5-liter VQ35DEDOHC56 engine found in multiple Nissan cars at the time, including the Skyline and Pathfinder. Released on July 2002 in Japan at reorganized Nissan Japanese dealerships called Nissan Blue Stage, and August 20, 2002 in the U.S., the 350Z Cooper copyright was available in five trim packages, 350Z, Enthusiast, Performance, Touring, and Track Editions. In Europe, only the track trim was available, although it was badged and marketed as 350Z. This engine initially produced 287 bhp and 274 lbaft torque, but in 2005 was increased to 300 bhp and 260 lbaft. Prices started at $26,000 US dollars, well below the $30,000 mark initially set forth by Nissan. Coupled to either a six-speed manual gearbox or five-speed automatic in comparison, it was initially available only as a two-seater hardtop. A convertible model was later introduced in 2004. The 350Z was available in a selection of seven trim packages, depending on the year, base, enthusiast, performance, touring, grand touring, track, and Nismo. The base model 350Z, in comparison to the more expensive packages, did not have a limited slip differential or a traction control system. Touring and grand touring models both featured leather seats. Bose Entertainment Systems, 
optional satellite navigation, VDC, and other user conveniences, while the Grand Touring models also added Ray's engineering forged wheels and the Brembo braking system found on the Track and Nismo models. In 2007, Nissan dropped the Track version in favor of the Nismo edition, but retained the Brembo brakes, Ray's engineering wheels, and simple interior, but added a larger exhaust and aggressive body kit. The second Nismo edition, released in 2007, included revised camshafts, a Nismo sport-tuned exhaust, custom Ray's engineering 18-inch wheels, front and rear spoilers and rear diffuser, and a Brembo braking system with four-piston front and two-piston rear calipers. The 2005 35th Anniversary Edition 350Z and 2006 350Z equipped with manual transmissions received a newly revised engine, which increased the read line to 7,000 rpms and increased power to 300 horsepower. 2007-2008 350Z models came with a 3.5 LV Q35HR engine with dual intakes and a 7,500 rpms read line, which produced a power output of 306 horsepower and featured a more linear power band in addition to the increased torque. At lower revolutions. It is widely believed that this model year is the most desired among enthusiasts due to the car featuring a revised transmission which solved all previous issues and the new engine architecture which provided an overall faster car. Equals sixth generation, Nissan 370Z equals. On December 30, 2008 the 370Z was introduced as a 2009 model. In June 2009 the second generation 2009 Nismo 370Z debuted. This was followed by the introduction of the 2010 370Z Roadster in late summer of 2009. The 370Z is powered by Nissan's 3.7-liter V6 engine, the VQ37 VHR. The power output ranges from 333 to 355 picoseconds, with peak torque of 37 to 38 GaM, depending on market and variant. The 370Z has an official 0 a Euro 60 miles per hour time of 5.1 seconds. However, the car has also been tested by Motor Trend magazine, which reported a 4.7 second 0 a Euro 60 miles per hour with one foot of rollout. Quarter mile times range from 13.1 and 13.6 seconds, thus making the 370Z the fastest production Z. The 370Z is available with either a six speed manual gearbox or a seven speed automatic with paddle shifters. The six speed manual is the first production car manual gearbox to feature a system that Nissan refers to as Synchro Rev Match, which automatically blips the throttle to match engine and transmission speed during downshifts thus achieving the same effect as the heel and toe downshift technique. The 370Z includes numerous styling updates to the previous 350Z, including improved interior cosmetics and ergonomics. The seventh gen may be in sight, as the refresh just happened this year as of 2015. Engines, the first two generations S30 and S130 of Z car were powered by a straight six with a displacement of 2.4L in the first incarnation, and increasing to 2.6L and 2.8L in the 260Z, and the 280Z and ZX, respectively. The second generation, the 280ZX, introduced in 1979 was a complete redesign, retaining only the L28 engine and other driveline components. A turbo option was introduced in 1981, bringing performance surpassing that of the original 240Z. The third generation, the 300ZX, switched to a 3.0L V6. There were two generations of the 300ZX, the Z31 from 1984 to 1989, and the Z32 from 1990 to 1996. Both the Z31 and Z32 came in either non-turbo or turbo trims. During the 90s the car's price continued to elevate and sales continued to fall. Even a major design change in 1998 couldn't save it, and production finally ended in 1999. While the model names were based on the engine capacity for the US markets, with the 240Z having a 2.4-liter L24 engine and the 260Z having a 2.6-liter L26 engine and so on to the 300ZX 3.0-liter V6, 
due to Japanese taxation laws relating to engine capacity some second and third generation Fairlady Z cars were produced for the Japanese domestic market fitted with 2.0L engines. The S130 was available with an L20ET in line 6, while the Z31 had either an RB20DET in line 6 or a VG20ET V6. In the 2003 model year, Nissan re-entered the U.S. sports car market with the 350Z, powered by the 3.5L VQ35DE V6 producing 291 picoseconds, and styled in an attempt to create a more modern interpretation of the 240Z's lines. It had a new six-speed manual gearbox, and is capable of over 155 miles per hour. The 350Z's engine was updated twice. In 2005 to the VQ35 DE rev up, producing 304 picoseconds, and in 2007 to the VQ35 HR, producing 315 picoseconds. The 370Z features a 3.7L VQ37 VHR V6 producing 333 Euro 355 picoseconds. This engine shares much of its architecture with the VQ35 HR, the primary difference being the introduction of Nissan's VBEL. Due to the similarities between the two engines, many OEM and aftermarket parts are interchangeable. Racing, the first generation ZS proved to be very successful in many forms of racing. The S30 S won many SCCAIMSA championships and even became quite successful in rally and barge races. The 280ZX proved successful in various classes of racing particularly in the U.S. Significant results include, 1979 SCCAC production category, 1979 and 1980 IMSA GTU championship, 1982 and 1983 IMSA GTO championship, the 1983 Electromotive 280ZX Turbo produced over 700 horsepower, and reached a terminal speed of 140 miles per hour in the standing quarter mile. The most notable driver to be associated with the car was actor Paul Newman, who raced with the Bob Sharp racing team. He also helped to promote the car, even by starring in a series of commercials. In 1984-1985 showroom stock racing, the 300ZX captured wins on numerous occasions. The car scored its only Trans Am win in 1986 at Lime Rock by Paul Newman for Bob Sharp Racing. From 1985 to 1987, the Electromotive developed GTP ZX Turbo was raced in the IMSA GT Championships GTP class and also the All Japan Sports Prototype Championship, badged as a Fair Lady Z, using a Lola T810 chassis and a VG30 ET engine. Following development through 1987, the car would become dominant in IMSA GT in 1988. Additional factory endorsement, combined with a new chassis, transmission and more reliable Goodyear tires contributed to the team's success. The SOHC VG30 ET was making upwards of 1,000 horsepower, with a power band that extended from 4,000 to 9,000 RPMs on a single turbo. From 1990 to 1995, Steve Millen drove the twin-turbo 300ZX for Clayton Cunningham Racing. The car dominated the IMSA in its GTO, then later GTS categories due to its newly designed chassis and engine. Millen would rank as the number one factory driver for Nissan for seven years and earn two IMSA GTS driving championships and two IMSA GTS manufacturers championships. Among enthusiasts and the team themselves, the biggest triumph for the race said 32 was the victory in the 24 hours of Daytona. In the same year at the 24 Hours of Le Mans, the 300ZX ranked first in the GTS 1 class and fifth overall. In an attempt to level the playing field in the GTS 1 class by reducing the allowable horsepower, the IMSA declared the twin-turbo VG engine ineligible. The 1995 GTS 300ZX car would debut with a V8 Nissan VH engine at Daytona and would place first in the GTS 1 class at the 12 hours of Sebring and Mosehead Grand Prix in Halifax. The JUN Blitz Bonneville Z32 holds the EBMS class land speed record of 419.84 km per hour set at the 1995 Bonneville Speed Trial. 
the vehicle was built as a partnership between JUN Auto and Blitz. This record remains unbroken. In 1990 June's first Z32 went 339.2 km hour at their Yata B test course and hit 373 km hour after some tuning at Bonneville. The 350Z replaced the Skyline GTR and Silvia as the car for Nissan's factory and customer teams in the JGTC Super GT's GT500 class and GT300 class respectively. The GT500 cars used were heavily modified and featured a longer nose and tail, carbon fiber bodywork, and a tube chassis. In 2004, NISMO won the GT500 championship. Until the 2007 season, the car was powered by a VQ30 DETT V6. In order to increase competitiveness, however, a new 4.5 LV8 power plant has been developed. The 350Z with slightly more pedestrian modifications also competes in the GT300 class by teams such as Endless Sports and Mola. In 2003 Hasami Sports won the GT300 championship with the 350Z. In 2008 season, the 350ZS were all replaced by Nissan GTRS in the GT500 class, but they have continued to be used in the GT300 class as the GTRS over exceed the horsepower limits which make it impossible to participate. Thus, two 350ZS competed in the series and MOLA won the both drivers and teams championships in the GT300 class. Two years later, Hazemi Sports won the 2010 GT300 title again before its team's withdrawal of the series in the following season as the another 350Z team MOLA also moved up to GT500 class earlier in the pre-season time, it marked the first full absence of Nissan vehicles in GT300 class since the establishment of JGTC in 1994. The Z33 is also popular in import drag racing, one Z33 fielded by Performance Motorsport in the NHRA Sports Compact Series, with twin turbo claims to put out over 1,700 bhp and achieved 8.33 quarter mile time with its best speed of 176.72 miles per hour. Another 350Z built by Injected Performance holds the record as the highest horsepower, street legal 350Z and highest horsepower single turbo VQ35 DE with a quarter mile time of 8.80 with a speed of 163 miles per hour. This car was also featured on the March 2008 cover of Turbo magazine. Lazzano Racing's 350Z is powered by a built Nissan VG30 DETT engine and has recorded a one-quarter mile time of 6.6 .6 at over 211 miles per hour. ZCON ZCON is an annual Z car convention that is held around the United States of America each year. It is considered the largest annual gathering of Z car clubs and enthusiasts in America, sponsored by Nissan. The convention is put together each year by a host club and supported by the ZCCA. References External links, Datsun Sports Roads to and Fair Lady Racing History, Classic Z Register, Datsun History, Z Car Club Association, The Classic ZCAR Club.